right, Garth Kemp is here with a look at the forecast. Garth, we uh, have some wet weather headed on. Yeah, all. here we go again, you guys. We're not quite done yet. Boy, what a pretty shot, though. Look at this. When this city gets rain, it is gorgeous afterwards for a while. Then it starts to get the pollution back. But before then, it looks really nice. Meanwhile, we're out towards Santa Monica. Then we'll take a beautiful shot farther away towards that same spot we were just at. That's from Malibu Camera. Looking down, but look at how pristine it out. It's clear out this evening. 59 degrees. Winds are calm right now. We're getting rid of some of the clouds. They're going to start to rebuild themselves back in. 47 right now, Lancaster. 57 down towards the airport. Fullerton, good evening. 58 for you. We head up to 67 today. A little bit below normal. So we're in this pattern right now. Nice strong onshore flow. Oxnard at about 10 miles an hour. Look at Fullerton picking up 15 mile an hour winds. We're going to start to pick up some wind advisories off to the east. That wall, they're actually going on right now until 11 o'clock tonight. We'll see if these extend out after this, but that's way off to the east. If you're going out to Barstow, Vegas, Havasu, you'll run into them to those high deserts, gusts up to 45, 50 miles an hour. Otherwise, we have weather advisories going online tomorrow. These will start at noon and continue through early Sunday morning. All of the mountain areas are going to pick this up. Besides the winds, we're going to see snow levels come down, especially. Friday night in the Saturday morning, we could see it down to around 3K, which means the grapevine could be affected by that one late Friday night, early Saturday morning. If you're heading north, also snow levels as they drop down like that, we could see one or two inches. I think probably what we'll see is four to six inches above 5,000 to 6,000 feet over the next several days. Great news for the local resorts, though. And man, going to get hammered up in the Sierras. Mammoth's going to pick up a couple of feet of snow. There's the rain Doppler radar. This one has a little more punch into it yet again up to the north as we have some uh, vertical development going on, which just means you have cold air. We destabilize. That gives you heavier cells moving through them. You can see them up by San Jose, Santa Cruz, Monterey by the peninsula. We're picking them up as well. So here's what we're looking at tonight, early tomorrow morning, no problem. By 7 o'clock, 8 30 tomorrow morning, we start to see rain in the Santa Barbara. I think by 10 30 to 11, we'll start to see it just stretch into the western part of Ventura County. Then as we progress through to the day, by around noon, we'll see it starting to get to western uh, San Fernando Valley, and then we continue on throughout the day. This one should bring us quarter, half an inch of rain or so in the lowlands, maybe a little more than that, three quarters to an inch, inch and a quarter in some of those foothills. I think there's a slight chance of a thunderstorm, but for the most part right now, no flash flow to watch us, so we're really on the bottom end of that USGS. You, uh, 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 threshold to pick it up, which you need about a half an inch of rainfall rate to get things going. But we've been seeing some sliding in some of those canyons we've been talking about. So we're going to keep an eye on this. By Saturday morning, though, we'll start to scoot it out of here. And then I think what's left through the rest of the day, you guys, just some showers up into the mountains of LA Ventura County, San Bernardino, a little bit of snowfall coming there as well. So check out your seven day. It's going to be cool. 59 tomorrow, 57 on Saturday, Sunday, uh, about 59. I think as we progress through the day on Saturday, it gets much, much better. Bigger systems starting to come our way next Tuesday night, Wednesday, Thursday. That one could have a little more punch to it as well. So we're in this pattern, and it is going to continue on. Now it's time for this week's Shameless Weekend Weather Plug. Hi, this is Ranger Mike here at Mile Square Regional Park in Fountain Valley. Please join us this Saturday for the Kids Annual Fishing Derby. We'll have over 2,000 pounds of fish, and registration starts at 7.30 a.m. So, Garth, how's the weather going to be? Well, I tell you, probably not as good as the sushi. We're going to be cool that morning. We could see a little bit of shower activity. There you go down by the park. Cool cumulus clouds through the area. I think temperatures early in the day will be just about upper 50s, low 60s. Not going to be much more than 63, but as the morning progresses on for the kids out there in the fishing, it should be really, really nice with daytime highs around 65 and just some clear air quality. What's better than a shameless guy doing the shameless weather plug? Oh, nothing. It's perfect. Nothing. Exactly. <laughs> perfect match. I've hit epic point in my career. Back to you guys. <laughs>